Chilling Discovery, 191 Decomposing Bodies Found in Colorado Home. A small Colorado town gripped by the unimaginable. Authorities stumble upon a scene straight out of a horror movie. 191 decomposing bodies, buried in secrets, unraveling as the unsettling truth comes to light. Meet John and Carrie Halford, a seemingly ordinary couple with a dark secret. As funeral home owners, they were trusted with giving loved ones a dignified goodbye, but no one suspected the chilling deception lingering beneath the surface. All it took was a persistent, unsettling odor for neighbors to alert the authorities. The subsequent investigation peeled back the facade to reveal a morbid operation that had been discreetly running for years. For years, the Halfords conducted sham burials and cremations, betraying the trust of grieving families. They handed over dry concrete instead of ashes, weaving a web of deceit that spanned since 2019. This despicable scam netted them a shocking $130,000. But their greed didn't stop there. They exploited the pandemic, illegally pocketing $800,000 in COVID-19 relief funds, a dark testament to their boundless avarice. Now, the duo faces legal reckonings, with the grim specter of 15 to 20 years in prison room. The charges are many, reflecting the depth of their betrayal, while affected families grapple with emotional scars. The news rocked the community to its core. Families of the victims are left in devastation and disbelief, their grief compounded by an unspeakable betrayal from those they trusted most. This case has ignited a national conversation on trust and ethics within the funeral industry. It raises critical questions about how such heinous acts can go undetected for so long and what safeguards can prevent them in the future. In the wake of this tragedy, authorities and communities are reassessing regulations and oversight in the funeral sector. The need for stringent checks is more apparent than ever to ensure such a nightmare never reoccurs. The sinister story of the Halfords serves as a chilling reminder of human fallibility. It's a call to action for us to demand better oversight, hold those in power accountable, and never underestimate the importance of due diligence. Demand truth, demand justice, and join the cause to reform and safeguard our communities. Like share and advocate for transparency and integrity everywhere, because sometimes a shared voice can ignite the change we all need.